it's happening. I watched Wolf Creek and pretty much every single one of you told me I need to watch the second one. So we're gonna do Wolf Creek 2 today. A bunch of you also told me that this is based on a true guy and his relative. Um, um sorry? sorry? I haven't looked into that yet because I didn't know if that would give spoilers for this movie in some weird sort of way, but I'll look into it after I watch this. I'm super excited. I really enjoyed the first one, and now that I know that there's no fear of aliens showing up at any point in time, I'm comfy and I'm cozy. Let's get into it. Thank you for being a friend. The following is based on actual events. 30,000 people are reported missing in Australia every year. This is the same intro, I love that. 90% are found within a month. The rest, taken by aliens. Some are never seen again. I love that we started off the exact same way. Do you think anybody survives this one? I hate listening to people eat. I also hate a police trap. If I want to go 80 down this little highway, there's nobody around. Let me be. Just let me be. <laughs> That's a familiar truck. Shit, it's an under. He doesn't know that. So you're not even supposed to go after him? Well, I guess you get what you get. Ah, <laughs> missed you. Oh, I'm so happy he's back. I was a little nervous it was going to be like a different killer. Oh no. Oh no. Now this is a knife. <laughs> God, the vibe of this movie is just so good. I'm uncomfy. He'll probably let him go though, right? Because killing police would be a crazy thing to do. G'day. <laughs> Get out of the vehicle. No worries. Oh, he's too nice. He's too friendly about it. You should pigs for a living. Bet your life. <laughs> yeah. Not bet your life. Yeah, I can read pretty good. <laughs> oh, and you'd be able to read the sign back there with the big one fucking double zero. He wasn't over a hundred. You nasty. You deserve the Bowie knife. You think I'm talking shit? Well, you are. No. No, look, it won't happen again, all right? Where the fuck you think you're going? Oh, my God. See, I want to fight. Don't put me in the side of the killer. Not really going to book me, are you? Can I see your license, please? Honestly, kill him. You're a long way from home, aren't you? The fuck does that matter? Not a lot of pigs down south. <laughs> Talk about you guys. <laughs> it's in order to take this car off the road. Body looks like you've thrown off a fucking cliff. Well, fun fact. <laughs> it was. You take this piece of shit back to town, and then you get the fuck back where you came from. Okay, go ahead and take them out of this world. Mate, you, you sure you want to give me this? Do it so you can die. I'm ready. All because they were bored. It's all because they were bored. Now, it is fucking messy to put me on the side of this man. I'm now rooting for him. <laughs> oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, here we go. Oh man, you sure you wanna give me this? Back at the end, oh man. One of their heads is just gonna explode. <laughs> I don't wanna look. <gasps> Cut clean in half. Mm, sir, you might need to take that off the road. I think it's a little worse for wear. Should have been going so fast. What a fantastic start. <laughs> also, the quality has gone up like a thousand percent from the first movie to this one. Where the bloody hell do you think you're going? <laughs> you got my leg, I think it's broken. That's... Oh. That'll do, pig. That'll do, pig. <laughs> Not the line from Babe. <laughs> I am a pig shooter. Is it one stop squirreling? Ooh, there it is. We're gonna stab the spine. <laughs> He's gonna burn him alive. I wanna see my kids. Oh. <laughs> I can make the ticket go away, mate. Or. I could make you go away. <gasps> oh. I know I said I was rooting for him, but like, maybe not. Ah! And that's a good way to start a sequel. Hey. Oh. oh no. I mean, let's just get started. 
Oh, getting the other one. Oh, oh, right. He can't be seen picking them up by somebody else. Don't worry, he'll come back around and find you. <laughs> you know what is so good about being somebody who doesn't leave their house? You don't have to worry about shit like this. And sure, you could say, well, you miss out on moments like this. That's fine. <laughs> They're cute. I'm sorry they have to have a brutal death. You know what would be fun is if they died like quickly and then we refocused on other characters again. A highly unlikely, but it would be cool. Black one's called Natilla. Little daughter's idea of a joke. And, uh, the oh other my one god. <laughs> What he's so angry for? That's heaven. Are you kidding? <laughs> Bye, Nutella. <laughs> oh, the cute little skulls are still there. Ich habe gedacht, bei uns zu Hause wäre es weit. Ah, da kommt ja einer. Okay, it's not the truck, but is it him in a different? Oh! You people, you're to stop or something! I would be. Yes, I don't want to take up a stranger. I'm boogieing around you as well. Someone will. You won't like it. Okay. Honestly, nothing is okay. You know, for it being freezing and in the middle of nowhere, your hair looks amazing. I don't want the bad shit to happen to them, but I'm also like, let's let's go. Rip that band-aid right off. Oh god. He just pulled up there like, this is my party now. This is a national park, you can't camp here, mate. Sorry, we did not know that was the case. Look at this bloody fire, mate. Hey, you haven't put it out properly. I don't like this. Name's Mick. Ah, um Rutka. 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 <laughs> I love him. I love him. Rutka says okay. Oh. Ew. Oh, through line. <laughs> I want to be disgusted, but he's so funny. As a matter of fact, mate, I'm going back through town so I can give you a lift, okay? Do you guys recognize the truck? I guess they can't see it, can they? Because they're like, the floodlights are in their faces. I'm going to give you one last chance to help you out. We will stay. Sorry about Oh, 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 that shifted so quickly. <gasps> the police are. Oh my god. Oh, I was gonna say the police wouldn't get there fast enough, but... Oh, I love that shot. That's so good. Now look, I didn't want to do you here. Your stupid fucking boyfriend forced me. Oh no. Is this the way you spend your life, through line? <laughs> well, baby, you're one to talk. I'm talking to you. Talking to you. <laughs> He's absolutely foul, but he still like has to rank up there for some of my like favorite killers. He's just he's fun. <laughs> <gasps> How? Girl, don't let him waste your opportunity like this. <laughs> oh, this is going to be bad. Oh, not bleeding him like a damn hog. The noises? The noises? <laughs> well, girl, you had your chance. A nice long few months together. Months? <laughs> oh, the shot is so good. It's like a replication of the car scene. And what a good transition. Oh. Non-smoker. <laughs> a non-smoker. <laughs> Come on, honey. <gasps> Shh. This is stressing me. The girl, don't do anything fucking stupid right now. Quietly back away from the slaughter of your boyfriend. Oh, but he's a hunter. He gonna find her no problem. Mm. Hide and seek, is it? <laughs> Not even worried about it. Oh, God. Hey, come on, 
jelly. He's evil. There you go, honey bunny. Don't run in a straight line. Clever bitch, eh? I'm gonna need her to be like a little bit more clever and hurry the fuck up. <laughs> Will she be found? <gasps> this is great. We have so many victims <laughs> coming in and out. Well, coming in, they're not going out. Ooh. Just get in the car, girl. Just get in the car. Get, oh, see, now. Did you get hit? It's your own. Does she look like she's been hit? Her wrists are tied. Put her in the car and drive. Uh, hey, is there anyone else? We don't need the conversation right now. Just go. It was fun to have him for a second. Thank you. Thank you, movie. They really said what well, worked in the first one. Let's repeat it. <laughs> and I'm glad they did. This is a pretty good endorsement for Jeep. <laughs> Let him drive, girl. Let him drive. I love him. <gasps> come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Jeep got their brand deal out of this movie. Oh shit. Oh shit. Did she just get shot in the head? Did he just shoot her? Oh <laughs> my god. After all that. <gasps> After all of that. Holy shit, we just traded characters. <laughs> I love it. I cannot believe that bitch just got shot in the head. Honey, baby, I'm gonna need you to get into your fucking Jeep and find the main road and go. This is not the time or place. You're just gonna leave her out here feeding the, the dingoes. Now what fucking for? <laughs> Someone tell me what we're doing right now. We are, we're just gonna fucking drop her out here. That's crazy. I'm sorry. Is he on the run or something? Like why? <laughs> or maybe just doesn't want to get wrapped up in it, which like fair enough. Oh, that's a good shot too. Sir, I am going to need you to just drive. Ah, uh, oh, it's the same map from last time. That's cute. Mm-mm, 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 mm-mm. The fuck? So much I Well, you do have blood all over you. Please, for the love of everything, get out of here. <laughs> Did he upgrade to a fucking semi? Oh no. Oh no. Hi! I'm not gonna lie, I love if he would just splatter him on the road. <laughs> no, it's him. It's him for sure. Oh, that's why we can't just drive. I don't know if we can win against a semi. Then again, we are Jeep endorsed, so <laughs> maybe. Bit of music, guy. <laughs> oh. <gasps> We're not gonna hit them, are we? Please don't. That's not funny to me. I can't watch that. I can't watch that. Sorry, Skippy. <laughs> I don't have words. <laughs> like I hated everything about that, but it was also just like really fun because it was wild, crazy, crazy, insane. The music made it. The music made it. 
Don't you dare run out of gas. I don't want to watch this. <gasps> yeah, what the fuck are the options now? Oh, he's gonna push you right over the side, but in like slow motion. So good. <laughs> Safety first. <laughs> Honestly, all things considering, not too bad. Once again, Jeeps can do anything. <laughs> he came to join you, or he sent the semi down. He's not in that thing. Come on. And now it all just looks like one big, unfortunate accident. <laughs> I love him so much. Why is he letting him get so far away? For the thrill of the hunt, I suppose. <laughs> to have some fun. Mm, it's so pretty. I would be very curious to know the difference in budgets between the first one and this one, because this one's gorgeous. The first one looked like it was filmed on a flip phone. Oh shit. <gasps> a house? Oh, this poor family. Whatever is coming to them, they don't deserve it. Is this his house? Does he have a family? What do you think? Oh God. Well, if there's animals hanging on the wall, it's probably his home. Is he feeding him to- Oh, gave you room and board. Now what's going on here? Do you think he has a whole family that lives here? So he can't be crazy Mick the killer around his wife and kids? I don't like this. We didn't know whether to wake you. Oh, okay, okay. What's going on? I'm Lil. This is Jack. Hi, Lil and Jack. I love you. Eat up. You'll need your strength. For what? For why'd you, why'd you say it like that? It's a pretty common phrase, but you know I can't trust anything happening right now. I made it special for you. The fuck does that mean? What does this mean? What? You're in there. I had enough mental damage from the kangaroos. I don't need this. If only it could be enough. It's not going to. Get off my property. What a badass. All of you that told me I should watch this, never speak to me again. <laughs> it's actually very good and I'm having a great time. The car's at the front. Get the keys, Lil. I can't. He's gonna fucking kill you guys. Oh my god. Oh my god. No! Shit. Not the music. Ah! Oh. Oh my god, no way. Could have had a good time, you and me. I am so sad for this nice old couple, but that was so good. The classical music, the shot in the doorway. Okay, you guys were right. Okay, you guys were right. This is so good. This is so much better than the first one. No, we are not going to chase. <gasps> Can we just talk about how they really replicated things from the first movie? The the funny gimmicks in the car. But they have just done so much better. This is so fun. <laughs> oh my god. Tall grass on horseback with a lightning storm. You couldn't ask for more. Is it so bad of me that I'm still rooting for the killer? <laughs> He's such a bad, foul, disgusting man. Shh. Mm. 
Boo, get on your knees and crawl. Please crawl, crawl. Oh, we just sat there and waited. Okay, okay. <gasps> no, no. This movie really said we're not gonna have a single boring kill. Nothing we do will be boring or standard or normal at all. Just leave me alone. <laughs> Fucking pommy, eh? Oh no. What I would love is if they utilized the dogs. What's his bucket? Rob? Steve? Whatever was in the cellar with the dogs in the cages, but like nothing really came of the dogs. Let's do something fun with them, please. <laughs> oh no. What made you think you could just take her away from us, huh? Mm -hmm. Even harder to be a smart ass with no fucking drum. <gasps> no, 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 stop. Fuck, I'm gonna go stuck, you cried. I don't give a fuck. I walked around looking like a dog. <laughs> what are you doing, Pong? Hmm? There once was an old lady. From Wheeling, who had a what the fuck is he doing? <laughs> well, yeah, I guess he does like jokes. Watch me while the bees feed. Darn the kangaroo down. I love that he's just like enraptured. He's like, down, <laughs> he's along. Get that up, huh? I love that he's just fucking insane. Like, to stop what you're doing, torturing a person, and you had a good little time, so now you're just gonna drink together? That's... Sir is insane. Oh, I got this little game we can play, huh? Aussie history! And for each thing he gets wrong, he, what, loses a finger? <laughs> that was fucking brilliant. What the fuck? <clears throat> What's that for me? Ah, oh, forgot to mention. For each question he gets wrong. For each one that you get wrong, I get to grind off a finger. <laughs> I was right there with him. See, maybe I'm just too similar. All right, we'll, we'll start off with an easy one. Just kill me. I don't want to fucking do this. Aboriginal term, meaning waterhole, is also the name of an Australian surf clothing company. Does it start with a B? Billabong. I was close. I was close. I was close. In what year did the British settle in Australia? 1852. 26th of January, 1788. Was a little bit off. A little, I guess I lose a finger for sure. Oh, I might have to let you go on that answer alone. <laughs> Probably gonna get pissed that he keeps getting shit right. <coughs> Smart. Cause see me, I would have been like, can I have some more? Another, another? <laughs> get rid of my feelings. Start deporting convicts to Australia. 1852. The first free settlers arrived in 1793. Mick. That's right, isn't it? Yeah, but he's not having fun anymore. He only wants to have fun. Why did the British deport convicts? To drop them off so they could die? On oh, you dumb fuck! They needed somewhere to put all the criminals that were stuck in England. What are you doing, Mick? Fuck, that's the right fucking- I don't- I'm uncomfortable, I'm uncomfortable, I'm uncomfortable. Jesus Christ, no, I got to right, come on, hey! Don't look, don't look, don't look, don't look. <laughs> You know, it's fucking right. What's the right answer? What's the right answer? The right answer is they are a pack of pommy cats. Oh, well, that's just not fair, Mick. You're right. No, technically. <laughs> come on, calm down, calm down. Just one finger. Honestly, this is what we get for even thinking that he, <laughs> he would play by the rules. Who's Australia's most famous Cricketer. Girl, I don't know. I think I'm down like an entire hand at this point. Dennis Lilly! Not fucking Dennis Lilly. It's Dennis fucking It's not Dennis Lilly! Use your fucking other hand! Oh. Who? Please make it, make it, make it, make it, make it! Ah. <laughs> keep him closed. Definitely keep him closed. <sighs> at least he has both of his hands free. Just let me out of here. First, I'm going to grab us another drink. Baby, get the hammer, please. Please. Thank you. Thank you. You're going to let me go now. <laughs> no one really gets out of here. Cute. He's really made a home of the place. You took away my play thing. You're just going to have to stand in for a bit. What the fuck? Soon turn you into a woman. Hey, <laughs> 
<gasps> Hurry the fuck up. And if you don't double tap. Stun Bradman, bitch. Oh, he lost his. <gasps> they never learn. I can't believe these fools. You took a beat to say the right answer. For what? <laughs> Not the laughing. <laughs> got to be fucking joking. Fuck! I was not, I was not ready for that at all. We're having such a good time, singing and drinking. Oh, there's the dogs. <gasps> let him out, let him out, Mick, let him out. Ah, fuck you. Come on. Yes. <laughs> I'm sorry, that's just fun. Oh, not the stairway to heaven. We're so close. Oh, oof. Now what the fuck? Was that necessary? Oh. Oh, he would have died. Why not just crawl into the pit and go around the spikes, you know? Oh, it's the girl. <gasps> He's such a good killer. He's so good at his job. <laughs> and people like me eat people like me. <laughs> Which makes you. <laughs> what? Oh no, where are we? Are we outside of a hospital? He let him live, cause he won the game? Did he frame him for a murder? You gotta help me. You gotta help me. I'm sorry, I don't trust that he just let him go. Despite his claims of a crazed gunman hunting tourists in the Australian outback, British tourist Paul Hammersmith was initially listed as a probable suspect in a series of unsolved murders in the Wolf Creek area. During the investigation, he suffered a complete mental breakdown and was deported to England and placed in full-time care at Ashworth Hospital, Merseyside. He is currently listed as a permanent resident. <gasps> For real? Mm, the same ending. I love that. Thank you. Thank you, Wolf Creek. Absolutely. Absolutely, yes. An entire round of applause. <gasps> nah, -uh. okay, okay. Onions, so Paul Hammersmith is really Paul Onions. Onions had just finished purchasing a drink at a store along the route when a passerby whom he thought looked like famous Australian cricket player Dennis Lilly that's hilarious apparently took note of his backpack and offered him a ride he accepted a ride from the man who inter introduced himself as Bill but whose real name was Ivan Malat who is the real killer that this is based off of ah <gasps> that's the killer that's the killer wow so the real story is not as intense for Paul, he like escaped, was never really tortured, but did help to identify the killer. Wow. Oh, wow. But that wouldn't be as much fun to watch, obviously. Um, that was a fucking blast. Everyone was right. This movie was better than the first one. The first one has some things that I love, which is primarily that nothing happened for so long and you never knew what the violent circumstances were for so long. And then poof, everyone died. <laughs> but this was so much fun. So much fun. Everyone was correct.